dragon is truly a living legend. It holds the title of the largest lizard species on earth, with some individuals growing over four meters, 13 feet long, and weighing more than 130 kilograms, over 280 pounds. But despite his massive size, this reptile isn't just a product of island isolation, as once thought. Scientists now know that the Komodo dragon is part of an ancient lineage of giant monitor lizards that originated in Australia. Fossils dating back more than 3.8 million years have been discovered in Australia. Around 900,000 years ago, this predator made its way to the island of Flores, where it managed to survive the mass extinction that wiped out much of the region's megafauna. Today, the Komodo dragon sits at the top of the food chain in its habitat. It has no natural predators except humans, reticulated pythons, and feral dogs. Juveniles live in trees and feed on insects and small animals, while adults hunt large mammals, feed on carrion, and sometimes even eat other dragons. For years, it was believed that their bite caused deadly infections due to bacteria in their saliva. However, recent studies debunked this myth. Komodo dragons actually have venom glands that secrete toxic proteins, though their exact role in hunting is still debated. What truly makes them deadly are their powerful jaws and serrated teeth, which resemble those of predatory dinosaurs and can easily slice through flesh. These lizards can bring down animals many times their size by cutting tendons or delivering fatal bites to the abdomen or neck. There have even been rare cases of attacks on humans. Komodo dragons also have a strong immune system, helping them recover quickly from injuries. They breed slowly, Mating happens between May and August, with females laying up to 20 eggs in September, often in nests they build or steal from birds. Unusually for reptiles, females guard their eggs. After a seven, eight month incubation, the hatchlings emerge in April. They take eight, nine years to reach maturity and can live over 30 years. First documented by Western scientists in 1910, Komodo dragons have since fascinated the world. Sadly, their wild population has declined due to human impact. Today, they're classified as vulnerable by the IUCN and protected under Indonesian law. The Komodo National Park was established specifically to help preserve this remarkable species. These lizards are solitary and typically come together only during mating season or around food, 